Communicate your ideas clearly, accurately and vividly. Use rhetorical devices to enhance and emphasize the ideas. Eliminate jargon and unnecessary words. Use correct grammar. Your time is 5 to 7 minutes. The title of Shaker's speech is Shaker the first time. The first time Shaker. All the best. You might have planned to gift your girlfriend. Sometimes girlfriends <laughs> are probably boyfriends. But gifting boyfriend is bad. <laughs> As a father, how did you feel when you touched your baby's finger for the first time? Shushil knows very well because recently he became a proud father. I have always believed that the first thing you experience is that test first and listen afterwards. And which lasts forever, isn't it? Good afternoon, Toastmaster and Grace, and my dear Amanda. What comes to your mind when I ask you about your first time experience? Now you may think about different first time experiences. Whenever I think about first time experiences in my dream, two different first time experiences which always come to my mind, which made me energetic, enthusiastic, and elated. The first one is when I was trying to enter into my dream for the first time as a candidate to attend the interview, the security guard stopped me. Even though I had showed them the interview invitation from the Human Resources Department, the security guard was suspected that the invitation was a wrong and fake. <laughs> I was shocked and started arguing with him. Then he dialed a number and told my name over the phone. After he put the receiver, he asked me to go to the phase two ground floor. He got an offer. And now I'm presenting my CC for proudly. This experience gave me a lesson that whatever happens to you, be always positive. The second experience is when I was traveling by air for the first time from Bangalore to Pune for the Mitre's digital event. I started home at 5:30 p.m. by Walla Cab service. As I started late, as usual. That cab driver drove the car like Michael Schumacher. <laughs> when we reached in an hour, airport. Though I have been to the airport a couple of times, however, this was the first time I entered into the airport premises. I didn't know really what to do, where to go. I decided to approach Indigo Airlines representative for the help since I was traveling by Indigo Airlines. They helped me and given the answer to all my questions why. At the security check, it was very tight. The, the guy who was asking me to remove the wallet from the fan party, since I kept my wallet from the fan party, because the security check was tight, they were checking each packet of my shirt and bag. He asked me in English, Hindi. I didn't really understand. I asked him in English. Sorry, I didn't understand. Sarcastically, he asked me, Do you know only English? Even I sarcastically repeat him, I know chuckle and French too. <laughs> <laughs> then he told me in English, can you please remove the ballot? After the struggle, security check, finally they allowed me. After long still, I was on the queue. While I was standing in the queue, I started taking photos using my camera. Without flash. The four passengers who were standing beside me, they were looking at me like as if I was a real person. There was a seven-year-old kid who was not at <laughs> While I was taking snaps. That was the first time I was seeing airplane so close. I was excited. I started sharing snaps to Facebook. To whom? To none other than my wife. <laughs> I get smiley response. Still, I don't know the meaning of smiley response. As soon as all the passengers boarded, the door got closed. There was a gorgeous, glorious, and graceful cabin crew who was standing <laughs> there who welcomed us. Good evening, sir. Welcome to the airline. For a moment, I felt that I was living in a dream. I just pinned myself to check whether it was real or not. Even I replied, good evening, thank you. 
my seat was middle apparently i expected window seat because the world is wonderful place one that looks entirely different from the above as soon as we boarded there was a gorgeous cabin crew cooked the mic and started announcing what to do what not to do it was exciting for the first time to see all the instruction we are flying at an altitude of 40000 feet though i was in middle i leaned myself towards window seat to see outside believe me i was so excited to see the actual city look like a toy this experience gave me a lesson that whether you grow or fly at high altitude your attitude should be down to earth the first time experience like a toy it has two sides success and failure success gives the confidence and failure educates you to gain success either to get the confidence or education you must start something for the first time once you go back to your workstation ask the question yourself when was the last time you did something for the first time or do you do something